Hey guys, if you wanna see how I went to that from this, please stick around. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Michelle, <coughs> girl, let me tell you something. We are over here dealing with no voice. No voice, but we still gonna do a voice over, cause what? Cause we're professional, okay? We're talented, we're motivated, and we get things done, amen. So today I'm coming at you with this beautiful 12 inch bob from OMG Her Hair. And I just wanna say something. I don't think I ever tried a kinky bob before in my life. So I'ma hit you with the facts real quick. She's 12 inches. It's 150% density, right? So here is the inside construction of the cap, right? You see that HD lace? That 13 by 6 inch deep parting, girl? Okay, deep parting. Look at all that space. The possibilities. So this wig was very comfortable. It was like the portion of the, the cap itself was really like fitted yet stretchy. So let me go ahead and show y'all all the other goodies. I got my little thank you card. There's a little scarf, wig cap. There's that adjustable band. I went ahead and added it back into the wig so it could fit oh so nice. I don't wanna waste time. I don't wanna waste time. I don't wanna waste You see what I'm talking about when I say natural? Look at that hairline, y'all. There's no baby hairs on this unit. I'm sure you could probably get them if you need them. You can make them if you want them, honey. It was already pre-plucked and it just looked super duper natural. Don't be questioning why do whatever feels right. Find your passion and fight. Cause we only go chance and got one life to live and it's do or die gotta make it count so lose your worries let your problems go now this cap came with a lot of lace why i came with so much lace i ain't never gonna slow down I plucked a little bit, but I had the wrong tweezers anyway, so I just stopped because it was, I didn't even need to. And what was I doing with those tweezers in the first place, child? So I use a little bit of foundation and I'm going in with some lace putty to go ahead and adhere this. I'm staying glueless. I'm probably going to be glueless all year, y'all. I'm using my favorite lace adhesive, the Lace Putty by She Is Bomb, because it is bomb and I love it. To make it easier for me to adhere the lace, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it into sections. And then I'm gonna go ahead and apply this scarf to let that adhesive work. So I let that stay on probably for about 10 to 15 minutes, I don't even remember. But when I tell you the melt, after I cut the lace off of this unit, it looked, I was like, where did it go? So I finished cutting off the lace and I'm like, where did it go? Where is the lace? That thing was melted. This is some lace adhesive spray by the Frontal Queen. Okay, it's giving laid and slayed, ma'am. So for some detailed touching up, for the spots that had lifted, um, or the spots I didn't think was very secure, I went ahead in with this, and then I used my blow dryer to make sure that everything was everything. Now if I saw somebody here looking like this walking down the street, you couldn't tell me that was a wig, okay? 
This lay spray is the bomb. So apologies for the jump scare at the beginning of the video. I'm gonna go ahead and get my face together, right? Let me beat real quick. I'll be right back. I still wanna party with her. Even when it don't feel right. You know I'm a party with her, with her, with her. She be calling on a Monday, wanna meet on Tuesday, asking me to fix me up real nice. She can wait until the weekend, she wants off the deep end, telling me to bring the stuff I like. I don't wanna let her down, so I'm telling her yes. So we are good to go. The only thing I'm gonna do is give this a light bump. Cause what? Cause I'm from the 90s. That's what we do. We give light bumps. Oh, she likes. I've been trying my luck. Every day of the week, yeah. With my baby and I wanted to keep that volume because the volume on this unit is out of control. I mean, it's kinky straight. So I went in with my thermal ceramic rollers. But I just can't get enough. She's slipping through the cracks, come up She know what's up. Can't get enough. Yeah, even when it don't fit right. So I really like the Claire Huxtable look it was giving me, but I wanted to do a little bit more customization of the front to have some kind of face framing layers. So I went in with that. I used my wax stick to make sure that everything laid perfect. So after the slide cut, I got these bangs together. So when you go in with the hairspray, honey, don't touch it. Don't touch it, just leave it. It's called freeze spray. You freeze it, you leave it alone, all right? And that's what I did. I love you guys. Thank you so much for suffering through this video with my crazy voice. All the information about this hair is gonna be in the description box below. I don't know, you know I'm in Georgia. I don't know if it's because the weather is warming up or whatever, and I'm just feeling real nostalgic, but I'm thinking about doing a 90s series. I am trying to find all the old hype hair sisters, sophisticates, black hairs, magazines I can find. Remember them old school salon books that were huge, that used to sift through, that used to look through and your mama never let you get any of the styles that were in the books. And then once you got old enough, the styles were out. I saw the girls doing 90s French rolls on TikTok and I was like, let's bring it back. So if y'all interested in that, let me know. I love y'all, I'll talk to you later. Bye. And it's do or die, gotta make it count So lose your worries, let your problems go on Until my whole body burns out I ain't never gonna slow down